Hey everybody, Rick's here. In this video, I want to share with you a pencil set that I came across. This one right here, and it's made by the folks at Four Candles. So, let's check it out right after this intro. Now this is a mechanical pencil set and it has everything, in my opinion, that you need in a mechanical pencil set. Let me tell you first off that this complete set runs currently around 13 bucks. And as I'm looking at the Amazon site at this moment, you can save an extra 5% if you select a couple items. But anyway, that's neither here nor there. All right. So, so it's $12.99 for this kit, and I think that's a pretty good deal, and I'm going to show you why. Now, it comes in this plastic case. You have a couple of latches down here that you've got to just kind of pull up on it. And there you go. Now, take a look at this thing. It has six mechanical pencils. And we're going to go check these out real quick here. All right, so these are 2.0s, and you have three of those. And as you can see here, you can set it to what kind of lead that you have inside here. It currently says HB. And here I have it set to 2B. And then it has 4H. And then there's 2H. Okay, I'm putting it back on HB. Now, these are preloaded. In other words, if you press right there, you can see that there is already a lead in there. Now, I know it's not really lead, okay? But that's what we call it. We call them leads. As a matter of fact, I'm not making that up. You can see right here it says... Get into focus, focus, focus. There you go. Resin lead. See that? Right above my nasty looking fingernail. Okay. So we call these leads. It is what it is. And if you see over here on the 2.0s, you have all these 2.0s, which I think is great. Look what you have. You have 4B. Okay, there's 12 pieces in here of 12, a 4B 2 millimeter that goes into this 2.0 pencil. But notice it's 4B and this pencil does not even have a setting for 4B. You can see you have 2B, 4H, and you have 2H. See that? All right. But there is no 4B. So let's take a look at this. We have HB, which we can set it to HB. We have the 2H, which we can set this to 2H. We have the 2B, which you can set this to 2B. However, we do not have a 4H, we have a 4B. Now, I would rather have a 4B than a 4H, but the pencil has a 4H setting. So this is a problem, and either you can just remember that your 4H is really 4B, or you can just set this to be reading nothing, and then remember that that means you have the 4B in there, or that you have one of the color ones, which I'm going to touch on in a second. So that's a problem. In my opinion, I think that's really sloppy, but it is what it is. I'm just telling you the good and the bad. I don't want to leave anything out. Obviously, the folks who provide the pencil set would rather that I not bring out the negatives, but I must bring out the negatives as well as the positives. And that's the only kind of deal I make on this channel for you guys, okay? So, as you can see, 
They come with its preloaded lead. It's got a point to it. It's really great. All you have to do is just hold this in and you can literally just move this in and out. You can adjust it by pressing on here. Push it back in if you want. You can pull the back end off and you can load your lead in through the back, which is how most people would do it. And I just want to make sure to see if there's an eraser associated with this pencil. And there is not. Okay. But that's not a big deal because we have two latex type or latex free. Let's see what they call these things. They just call them erasers, but it's the white erasers. You get two of those. And then you also get this kneading eraser for artists like you. You want to draw some really good photorealistic drawings. You need this. All right. Now, as I said, you have three of these 2.0s. As you can see here, there's another one. It also is preloaded with lead. Now, from what I can tell, these are HBs that are preloaded in here. So, I'm going to grab some paper here. Let me grab another one here. You can see that I was already having some fun with this thing. But let's, we can just go like this. And I can tell you right off the bat that that's an HB, all right? That's HB, so these are preloaded with HBs. And you can change them out to two H's, which is harder, a lighter pencil. Then you have your two B's and you have your four B's. Your two B's and your four B's are going to be a lot softer, and we're going to go over that in a second, all right? I also want to show you that there are three other mechanical pencils here. Has a nice rubber grip down on the bottom. These have a kind of a braided metal bottom here, as you can see. It's hard to get things in focus here. There we go. So you can see the difference between the two pencils. Now, this one here says 0.5. Then you have this one that says 0.7, and then you have this one that says 0.9. Alright, so you don't have that turning thing like you do on the 2.0s so that you can set the different leads that you have in there. You just have the size of the lead. You have the 5, the 7, and you have the 9. Okay, but the reason for that should be really clear in that in the lead section here, you only have HBs and you have the 0.5, the 0.7, and the 0.9. Now, going back to the 2.0s, because the 2.0s I think is where all the action's at, and I've got one right here. We're going to do some things with these different LEDs, all right? First thing I'm going to do here is, you've already seen me draw this HB, so I'm just going to go ahead and mark this HB, and I'm going to leave this as an HB. Now I'm going to take this next one, I'm going to set this to 2B, and I'm going to hold this thing down, well I'm going to click it a few times, then I'm going to hold it down and pull out the HB that comes in there. And we're going to put in a 2B. I'll show you a couple of ways you can do this. Comes with 12 of them. As you can see, 12 of them. Now, you can hold this down and you can push this in through the bottom, which is the way I do it to save me time. All right, and there you go, voila. 
Or if you want to do it like the way you're supposed to, I guess, officially do it, right? You take the back part off, you got that hole there, and you can stick the lead down in there. And then you can push this cap thing back on and then do this a few times and there it comes. So you decide which way you like to do it. I like to just put it in from the bottom here. Okay, now this is the 2B, so check it out. See how it differs from the HB. It's a softer pencil. But there you go, there's a 2B and you can see that it is darker than the HB. All right, and I have that marked as 2B, I'll leave it there. So the next time I come back to my kit here, I will know what it is. Now as I mentioned, there is no setting for the 4B, which is this one right here. It only says 4H. There are, there are no 4H's in this kit, but I'll just leave it as 4H. And then when I draw, I'll know automatically, oh, that's definitely not a 4H in case I forget. I'm holding the end down and just pulling it out. And I'm going to put a 4B in there. Now be careful with these. They are somewhat fragile. And I'm going to just stick it in the end here. See how easy it is just to do it this way? That's the way I like doing it. All right, and let's just do the 4B. Okay, and that's supposed to be the 4B. Whoops, I forgot how to write 4B. Okay. Now, I personally don't think 4B looks any darker than the 2B, but you be the judge, maybe a little bit. Uh, I don't know. But that's what that is. That's your 4B lead. Okay. Okay. So, I've now preloaded my pencils here. I'm going to push these leads in. So that they all have room in this kit here. Now here's something else that this kit comes with that I think is really cool. And that's these two pencil sharpeners here. Now as far as I can tell. They're identical. So you just get two of them. And these are great to put a point. So you just open that puppy up like this and it looks like it's a two-stage type setup. Stick the lead out a little bit, give it some space there. Now let's see, I'm gonna that feels like the point. So let me try this first first one here and see what happens. Okay, so it gives us this kind of a point here, if you can see that. Then we'll grab a different pencil over here so we can do a comparison. And now I'm going to do the other hole here. Give it some more length there. That one felt a little more aggressive. Let me just make sure I did this right. And we're going to compare the two. You tell me if you see a difference. All right. You see a difference? Hmm. They're both pretty pointy to me. So, I'll let you be the judge of that. But once you got a point, you get the point, right? Yes, that was a pun. Okay, so there you go. I got two nicely sharpened pencils. 
So it's pretty handy little tiny pencil sharpener there that sharpens them to a point. And you get two of them in the kit. Put one in your pocket, take it wherever you go, leave the other one at home. And again, I'm going to now push these points in. There. And there, so I could store it in this case. Now you may be wondering, what's this little thing? Well, these are eraser refills that it comes with. Don't lose them, but there's these tiny little eraser refills, and they go in these mechanical pencils that you see here. The 0.5, the 0.7, and the 0.9. I got the 0.7 in my hand right now. If you pull the cap off, you see that you'll have this little eraser in here. Okay, so you obviously do not feed the lead, the lead in there, but you probably could fit the lead in there. Let's try that. Okay, I'm going to push down on this thing a few times to get the lead out. Okay, better have this cap on if you want to do that. So I'm going to pull this out. All right. Okay, so there's no lead in this pencil right now. And now I have this little thing in my hand and I'm going to just push it down into the back here. And I'm going to say, okay, there it goes. It finally went in. I thought, what in the world is not going in? Okay, let's see if that works. So you put the little eraser back in again. Put the cap in and let's see if the lead comes out the other end again. Yes, it does. There it is. Okay. Because this hole is a little smaller than the 2.0s, you might find it easier to put it in here than to put it in here like I did with those. All right. Something to keep in mind. But anyway, uh, by the way, I was incorrect in the beginning. This thing does have where you can tell it the type of pencil. Okay, in other words, this one is an HB, it says right here. Now, you turn the whole shaft like this, and you find that HB seems to be the only choice. There are no other choices here. There's HB, then there's HB, or you can set this to HB. Isn't that fascinating? All right. So these will only say HB. Not much different than what I did say originally. All right. And you have, like, here's the 5.0, and I don't have anything showing there. Let's see if I can get it to say something brilliant here. Why, look. HB. Wow. All right. So that's the 5.0. And here's the 9.0. And it should be a thicker lead. I imagine that is. See, that's supposed to be the 9.9. .9. This one's the 0.5. Yeah, it's definitely different. You can see. Look at the 0.5. There's the 0.9. So, there's three diam diameters here depending on which one you want to use for your details. Okay, so the erasers, these little erasers right here are for these three right here, the 0 0.5, 0 0.7, 0 0.9. The 2.0s apparently do not have an eraser. You can use these erasers, of course. And there's the kneaded eraser you use for everything. Now, what you see in this kit, you're seeing the 0 0.5, 0 0.7, 0 0.9 HBs. That's the only kind you have in here, HBs. You can always go out and buy uh, softer leads if you want for the 0 0.5, 7, or 9. Here are your 2.0s. Okay, you're going to get the HB, you're going to get the 2H, you're going to get the 2B, and you're going to get the 4B. But here's something you may not know. If you look under here, you're going to get not only the color, but you're going to get more color right there. There 
are 24 pieces of the color. And let me show you something I did here. See, I messed around with a couple of them. So it's really cool that you can take one of these 2.0 pencils, for example, take the lead out, swap it for any color you want. And I mean, it's a whole rainbow of colors. Look at this. I think this is really cool to have. So this time I'm going to use one of these orangey red ones, orange or pseudo orange. I don't know what that is. I think that's kind of a bronzy orange. What do you think? Orange? All right, we'll go with orange. I'm going to slip it in the bottom here like I normally do, carefully, while holding down the top. I'm going to slide that puppy in there like so. Be careful because they're soft, of course. And then you can write or draw in living color. Yeah, look at that. That's orange. Now, personally, I'm going to want to get a few more of these 2.0s and preload them with all the colors rather than having to swap them out every time I want to change a color. That would be a real pain in the old Canusa, won't it? All right, so we're going to put that back in. But you get two of those. See if I can get to that. You also get, let me, uh, let me, let me work this one out here. All right. If you look under the point nine here, you'll see that there's another point nine. There's another point seven. And of course there's another point five. So you're actually going to get 120 pieces of the point five. 120 pieces of the point sevens. 120 pieces of the point nine. You're going to get 24 of the color. And then you're going to get 12 of all these multiple uh, 2.0s here. Multiple points. Okay, so this is a lot of stuff. In my opinion, this is a lot of stuff for just $12.99. I mean, that's not very much money. I've spent that on just one pencil with lead easily. So, I think this is a really good deal. I wanted to share this with you guys. Uh, as far as, again, what I do not like, of course, is I don't like that you don't have a setting for the 4B. But that's a minor thing. All right. It's not going to prevent me from using this. And you got this great kit here, six different pencils, all these LEDs. I don't think you're going to run out of leads for like forever. I mean, it's it's more than I'll probably ever use in my lifetime. But anyway, there you go, folks. I certainly hope you like getting this sneak peek of the Four Candles 25-piece art mechanical pencil set. It's available on Amazon. Yep, there's a linko down in the description area. And if there's a discount code available, uh, it will be down there as well. Hope you like it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think about it. And uh, that'll be it until the next video. If you haven't already, please subscribe. Click the notification bell so you'll be informed of my next video. I'll give me a like just to help me out because you like me. Please. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.